Design is a, is a great um, global force of uh, designers. People here aren't scared of um, applying technologies. Everyone is really experimental in their approach. I've seen Philips always as a very innovative company and with a very conceptual approach. It's nothing else as finding a good, honest, working, sensible mm -hmm. solution. Mm -hmm. Creating solutions that really add value to people's lives. The left brain deals with logic and uh, deals with very rational judgment and thinking. The creative director and the design team is actually uh, very much playing the right hand side of the brain where we provide the creativity. In order to develop creativity in a, as a powerful uh, engine, it is important to develop a very strong community with uh, a very high level of shared values. We get challenged uh, every day to work with our creativity, to think differently. We start every project with a workshop where we get all the different disciplines involved. We have a, a number of skills and capabilities that we employ and can link together in uh, various combinations uh, to supply the right design solution to the problem of our client. So it enables us to come quickly to a solution understanding that we've worked with some of the best experts in the field. The act of creativity has to be fundamentally led by really love. I believe that uh, in principle we cannot talk about innovation if it is not recognized as such by, by us, by people. We do not see people as passive respondents, but really as co-researchers, as well as co-creators, to truly uh, create solutions that uh, improve the quality of their lives. We always want to see uh, also new opportunities uh, for Philips, maybe that's not in the kind of core uh, business of what they're doing at the moment, but having the opportunity to maybe go off and explore other sorts of dimensions and other kinds of uh, projects. There is a, a clear challenge to, uh, to the world, to industry, to find solutions uh, that are not just other solutions, but to find solutions that have a very clear long-term uh, projection. It was during university actually where I was browsing through one of these projects, uh, Visions of the Future at that time, and I was really impressed by it, really intrigued. Vision of the Future was a what if, what kind of project, looking 10, 15 years ahead. It was an internal research looking at the future of multimedia in the various domains that Philips is active in. What has been interesting for product designers is, is, is to think beyond the form and to be creative in a new domain that was traditionally the domain of engineers. An idea on paper is not sufficient. The best way is by making working demonstrators. The program we're working on, the PROBES program, is looking at far future design research, which is looking at lifestyles 15 to 20 years ahead. The Skin Probe is our most recent project, looking at elements and issues around emotional sensing. We use garments as a way of demonstrating the relationship between the human body and the environment. The work that gets, that's going on in the Probe's project, that's quite provoking. I think it's because we dare to do these sorts of things. Those are the things I think that make us special. Experience design is something that we've been focusing here at Philips Design. An example is the MRI examination. Frequently patients suffer from claustrophobia. With ambient experience, we use lights and projections and sound to try and calm the patient, to uh, make them less anxious. And as a result, the clinicians are able to get better results and through that, uh, they get better diagnosis. Not all the ideas are a solution for the long term, but all the ideas, also the ones that have a proposition at a relative short and mid term, should be ideas that build toward 
that long-term uh, solutions of uh, an holistic quality of life. To see something that uh, started up in design research implemented into a real solution in real life situation, that was a very rewarding experience. Sustainability has been always uh, at the heart of the Philip Design Vision, or our philosophy. There is the opportunity to create uh, new ideas that in themselves represent a proposition for improving quality of life of people in regions that do require very different uh, level of solutions. Possibilities to grow within Philips Design is interesting and growing is not just in Korea but also doing different kind of jobs and that makes it worth staying here for a long time. Design is, is only as good as the stimulus around you so if you're around people who are experimental uh, and open-minded then the design that follows is, is really amazing. I have been gaining more and more insights in what complexities that we have to deal with in this world in designing global products. I think the most rewarding part about working at Philips Design is um, the people, being able to uh, work with so many different kinds of people from different backgrounds, you know, different nationalities. And then of all of them working together on one big project or on different projects, that's really what triggers and what's the uniqueness of Philips Design. We have designers that understand the global picture, but they have also insight in the local environment. And that together shows that there's not one particular way of thinking or doing, but it shows you can also explore beyond your own boundaries and look at what's out there uh, for tomorrow. My perspective uh, of the future is the one to uh, make sure that uh, we keep uh, creating a learning organization, building on, uh, on uh, our cultural program, building on the training with uh, a clear core and focus on the interest to advance people quality of life.